music going on. Hello. There's music in the background. There's so, music that no one can hear apart yeah, from had, us. No, no one has been able to hear it, but it's... Can, can we get copyrighted for that? Uh, well, it's playing on the radio, so hmm. I don't think... Because anyone could listen to that. I suppose so. so. Oh, here we are, back at it again with... So we're with... Not knowing who's oh, live. We got, we got one person. Hello, one, one person. Oh, that tick? Oh, we've got five people now. Hello, five people. El oh, 12. 12. <laughs> oh, we're doubling up. Now... Hello, uh, everyone. How is everyone doing? Happy Friday. Friday. Um, yeah. It's bank hall weekend. We are incredibly excited. I can't... Happy's actually playing in the background. So... That's such a good... Uh, yeah. I didn't even deep so, it. Wow. Don't know if anyone can hear the song on the radio in the background, but it's uh, yeah. It's, it's Pharrell Happy, which is exactly how we. Are. Would you like me? It was answered at the beginning of this as well. Yeah. Um, so that's why. Yeah. But yeah, Happy Bank Holiday Eve. Yeah. Yeah. Is it? Yeah, it is. Happy yeah. Bank Holiday Eve. Um, today we're kind of going to get straight into it. We've got a giveaway as always. We're going to be giving away two fifty pound vouchers today, so we've got two lucky winners. And I think our competition today is a bit different. Yeah, we've got a different competition one. style. We're not doing darts. No, we're, we're not doing anything. We're not doing jokes. You know, we're trying to keep it interesting, keep it this all. This is rather than one of, of our physical Yeah. Balance. This is of our mental. This is of our mental. So we want to see if we're just as bad... Mentally as we are. As we are physically. Because as we've all seen... Mm, yeah. yeah, it's a bit awkward. Well... <laughs> but yeah, so today we're going to be doing a... Na so this is one of our products. We've got a 90s quiz cards and a charades game so we're going to be actually doing the quiz you get 100 questions 50 cards and it's all based on the 90s so we're going to be um answering five questions each and whoever guesses the right person to win is in for a chance of winning 50 pound voucher all you have to do is guess who you think is going to win between peter and i tag a friend and share this video i mean i think with that quiz i've got a slight advantage because i am older and was born yeah he is older the 90s. i was just I basically just slipped out of the 90s. I was 99, so... Uh, I was old 96. But yeah, this contains 50 90s quiz cards, 50 charades quiz cards, and it covers four categories. Movies, book, music, and TV. I really hope I get TV or music. I hope I don't get music. I, I'm off with anything music. <sighs> I really TV hope TV so. you can do. Movies. I'll be, I'll be great with movies. I'm just nervous. I, 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 I I'm just really least. nervous. So yeah, so we're giving away two fifty pound vouchers. All you have to do is... Tag a friend, comment who you think is going to win in the quiz between Peter and I, and share this video. Good luck. Yeah, oh my did. gosh. Someone's already said you're going to win, Peter. Oh, well, Again, he's got an unfair advantage. Well, uh, <laughs> I'd like to add that. The, 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 that advantage of, of being in my older years, I've got Yeah, my, he's old. I'm young. I've got I'm the youthful. wisdom and the, you know. I basically just hopped out the room. <laughs> those extra four years, is it four, three years I've got on you? Is it four? Three, three, three years. Three years I've got on you. Yeah, yeah. three years. So, uh, uh, everyone's saying Peter. Wow. Ow. <laughs> Thanks, everyone. Like, I agree, but ow. <laughs> I mean, this is where I lose horribly. Horribly. Like, I pray for that. Um, before we get into the products that we're going to be going to, we'd like to introduce you guys to the Pound Toy Stars, which you can probably see on the bottom. Um, we have just set up our pound toy stars and our pound toy fan subscriptions as well we did all this yesterday these are all new and not all accounts have them they're for small businesses and small accounts and they're basically here to sort of show you guys that you support us and you can give us stars to support the business um i believe once you sort of set up facebook will let you know what each star is the equivalent of i believe it's what is it is it a stars or something i think i think something you about can buy like a bundle about a penny yeah, you can buy a bundle of stars and then with those stars you can um, support whichever business you choose, whichever account that you choose. Um, we've got ours enabled, so if you'd like to give us some stars, you're more than welcome to do so. And we've also got fan subscriptions, so uh, we set ours up for 99p a month at the start of every month. And with that you'll get exclusive discount codes, you'll get exclusive lives set for you guys, um, so you can get the first top picks. And it's basically just our appreciation to you. So you support us and we support you with the best deals. I think for that. Thank, thank you, Angie Chapman. She just sent us 50 stars. Oh, well, thank, thank you, Katie you. Thomas. Oh, you guys are so cute. Thank you very much. And I think with those, um, with the 99p subscription as well, that we've yeah. got, I think that's, you know, like 99p. Yeah. Get those we went for the extra. lowest um, membership possible because at the end of the day, we do want to give you guys something. We do see quite a lot of you have actual top fan badges so it'd be nice to support you guys and it's not a contract or anything so you can cancel it anytime thank you bethany 
much. Well, thank you very much. Stars. But yeah, we got stars last week, and we were like, Yeah, we, we didn't know what, what does they were this last mean? Week, so. We were like, <laughs> What is this star? So, did our research, and we've set it up properly now. So, yeah, thanks for supporting. Thank you, Ashley, because Ashley said Chantel's gonna win. That's the first person I've seen. But, and Terry. Thanks, guys. Thank you. <laughs> now the pressure's on. Well, I mean. <laughs> thanks, Anne Marie. <laughs> I mean, I'm not, and Jess, uh, I keep doing shout outs to everyone. I'm, I'm just, I'm just gonna. Every time someone says my name, I'll be like, Yeah. I know if you. Oh, Natalia, tell us and tell us and tell us hi. See what I did there. See what well, I did there. Yeah, yeah, uh -huh. yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. Thank you. Nomination tells out there. Thank you, Steph. Um, so yeah. So in the meantime, we're going to be going through the products. So Peter, do you wanna? The, I'll start with. Because the weather's been, obviously, not quite as nice today, but we're getting a taste of summer and the nicer weather, right? Gemma's a supporter. Welcome to the family, Gemma. Welcome. Um, but our first, I don't know why I said welcome so bizarrely. Welcome. But uh, our, our, <laughs> well, first, uh, our first product is, is yeah. the boomerang. Um, so, obviously, great outdoor outdoor toy. Never used a boomerang. I'd probably end up hurting myself. Yeah. Um, but I think most other people would be quite capable with a boomerang. I've personally never used one. So, again, great for when summer's actually going to come around. Yeah. Um, we've got, you know, the past two <laughs> summer days. Summer will come around like you come around. Oh, <laughs> that's well, well, yeah, good, isn't it? Yeah, like, yes, yeah. I didn't like the joke. Uh, I'm ignoring Peter's joke. <laughs> like, the jokes are difficult to hear. Um, so that's the boomerang. And... We'll also, I think I'll, I'm going to start with a penny product. Ooh, good idea. So, these are 1p. It's a pack of munchies. I'm actually still shocked that these are 1p because it's a full pack of munchies. Like, it's not like you get three or whatever. It's a full pack of munchies. Um, they are 1p and I believe RRP is 4.99? Yeah. Yeah, RRP is 4.99 for them. Get this for 1p. These would have been perfect for Easter, but I do believe that it's very last minute to get your order for order for Easter. Thank you, Stacy. Samantha just said that your jokes are as bad as hers. <laughs> well, I mean, at least there's... I like the commitment and the some, honesty behind that, both of you yeah, guys. I, I, at least there's someone else that's on my level as well. That, that's, <laughs> that's I like what we to need. know I'm not alone. That, that's but yeah, the these are 1P. Perfect for stocking fillers, perfect for keeping them in the house. I mean, they're all year round treats. Munchies are delicious. They're my favorite. I, they're not my first pick, but for 1P, they will always be oh, my yeah. first pick. If, if, if saw them in the shop and they're 1P, I'd always go anything for it. else, that'd be what I'd go exactly. for. Exactly. Um, so, next one, again, talking about the whole summer theme, is the, I forgot the actual name, the bubble sword. So, it's like one of those giant I think you can open it. bubble things. I think you can open that. Ah. ah, I do know. Ah, so you get this, and then you just ta-da! I, I was gonna. I didn't know that you had to do that. I was going to try and blow in. in into I mean, it, you like, can yeah. blow into it, but it's a lot of effort. <laughs> so yeah, it's the bubble sword. These come in a variety of different colors. It is one cent at random. This is also a penny. So again, like great for summer, just with the boomerang. That's not a penny. This is a penny. Um, the reason why we picked summer products is because we had two days of summer, and we have not. No, we, we don't know how to act really so you um, know uh, just as every person in britain you yeah. get the first taste of summer you just start barbecues going a bit, everything a bit mental with that um there. so yeah we're gonna go through a few products and then we'll go straight into the quiz guys so keep commenting who you think's gonna win between peter and i we're gonna be doing a 90s quiz five questions each tag a friend comment if you think is gonna win and share this video and you will be in for a chance of winning a 50 pound voucher we're giving two vouchers away so, so. Uh, I think because it's uh, quite a bit of a different competition that we're doing. I do this one more time. <laughs> that I keep doing film. this. It's, why? <laughs> I mean, you just, sometimes you just got to roll with the finger guns, right? Oh, thank you, Stacey. Stacey keeps sending in stars. We'll probably do giveaways and everything dedicated around stars and everything. So we will be doing a lot more work into making sure that you guys receive some goodies as well for supporting us. Which is, uh, yeah. So what's our next product? Shall we go Another with... Penny? Another penny? Oh yeah, try to say this word. Right, I think it's called smooshy mushy. Like, smushy. or is it smushy mushy? I think it's smushy mushy. But it's got two O's, so. Oh, smooshy mushy. I mean, it makes oh. more sense calling it smushy. Anyway, yeah. anyway, we digress. <gasps> Hi, Mimi. So these are what are these? I love Besties. Mimi. Like, so they're like. Yeah, it's, like a, it's a blind bag but and i think they've got like smells so you get 13 to collect so again these are only a penny um 13 to collect i'm pretty sure they've got yeah they're scented 
Samantha, just put penny for your thoughts. <laughs> we do the penny deals. Uh, yeah, I like that one. Oh. I mean, a penny for my thoughts is, wouldn't be a thought. There's there, not there's anything. There's nothing there. Wow. Um, so yeah, these are blind bags. Uh, really good for like little soft toy. Um, you get like all the different designs. I'm rambling yeah. about what these are. Yeah. Not very good at explaining things. As always. Um, as always. And yeah, I like I say, guys. I think they are scented uh, like little soft toys type thing. Yeah. Um, but I quite like the designs of them. So mm -hmm. what do you get? You get a, a <laughs> Cocoa Muggins. I don't like that name. You get either. Toasty Jam Jar. You get Penelope Pastry. Oh dear. Um, Francois Frenchum, which is some French fries. Um, so yeah, those are all the... Oh, that's so cute. Guys, look at on one of our favorite. Look at this is the elephant. It's Ellie the elephant. Favorite hand puppet toys. Perfect for babies. They're really soft and they come in different designs as well. Get, oh, I want it. Can I touch it? I want it. They won't give me it. <laughs> Ellie won't come to me. <laughs> this is so cute. They are. Oh, <laughs> I felt very Lion King esque. Yeah, yeah, it just yeah. fell down. That's um, the hand puppet toys. They're really cute. We spoke about them on the last live, actually. They're so soft. I really like, yeah. um, they're my first toys, so perfect for newborn babies. Um, was that all you had to say about the blind bag? Except that it's <laughs> super cool. Super cool and it's one p. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's a bigger, yeah. And we've also, another penny product, we've got five penny deals this week. <sighs> it's unheard of, really. I mean, we did it last week, but... We're it's amazing. We would definitely like to keep these like great penny deals. We yeah, our penny deals going. are now different. It is one that change weekly. So make sure you keep a lookout on Wednesdays. That's when we do our announcements for the new penny deals. Um, a personal favorite of mine is the Jelly Play Pods. These are Zimply Kids and the pod, you just squeeze and pop it open and you'll get a sachet. This big ah, mm. of Jelly Play Solution. So these are also a penny. Um, the designs at the front mimic all the emojis. It's one set at random though, so they all differ. But I think for a penny, you don't really mind, do you? No, oh, no, absolutely. Yeah. Emojis. And it's scented as well. So it's just the normal jelly play, but jazzing it up a little bit for your little ones. And I love these. I think my favorite one that we've got here is the uh, Sonic Boom Mini Jigsaw Puzzle. In fact, um, is this my favorite one? No, I like the book. Bubble I like sword. the bubble sword. The bubble, the bubble sword, sword. Is, my, is my favorite one. This is a close second. Um, I mean, you know, Sonic um, Jigsaw. Yeah. In a bag. What more could you want for a penny? Um, so yeah, if, you, if you've got anyone that's a fan of Sonic, this is a pretty... This is definitely a different... You know, for, for one P, it's, it's oh, definitely, a, you know, one <laughs> to go for. So yeah, so there are penny deals. We've got the Magic Bubble Sword, the Sonic Blind Bag, Smushy Mushy Blind Bag, 13 to collect. A pack of munchies and the jelly play pod they're all 1p they're all live right now check them out in our toy clearance which um is there and ready to be used i think we're gonna go into the quiz now so make sure you've tagged a friend comment who you think's gonna win and share this video we want to give everyone a chance of winning and everyone play along with each question yeah play along like. with us you know, post your answer. We, when, when we're answering, we can't look at the screen, yeah. though, because we don't want to Yeah, let cheat. us know. And um, so, yeah, let us know what you think the answers are as well. So play along with us. Um, and it's 90s This quiz. is 90s. I'd also like to add once again, guys, Peter has an unfair advantage. Uh, I've, got, I've got those three years in the 90s more than you've had. So. <laughs> of course. So <laughs> this is the packaging that it comes in. You get two decks you've got one for our charades in this case 50 cards as well and you get another deck for the cards and we do sell this by the way guys so then you open it like this and then oh my god i'm nervous you know how do you think you're gonna do if if, if i get anything music wise i'm gonna i'm gonna lose okay that's fine um do we, should we bother shuffling them because i mean i mean we don't know what order we're not in the so. deck before have we i mean might as well shuffle them i think so this is the deck of cards. Um, I also really don't know how they've done that. They're all like... I mean, why would oh, you do yeah. it that way? Bit of the wrong way Who around, did though. this? <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Oh, so oh, I was being dramatic. It was just the. <laughs> It was just the it was last round, time. It was just la- the last um, time. Stacey, it's true, Pierre is older than I am. He's three mm. years older than me, so he's got three years more experience in the 90s than I do. Born in 96. So I was born in 99, so basically I just hopped out in the 90s. So uh, I was... Unfair advantage, but you know... I was there to see it all, friends. I'm a trooper, and... I'm a survivor, you know, I believe in myself and... It's not, it's nice, it's nice one of us believes in you. I'm sorry, that was really mean. <laughs> <laughs> that would really me. I promise we get along sometimes. <laughs> I'm leaving. I'm, I'm sorry, Chantel. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Whatever. So we get five cards each. I'll give you five. Two, two, two three, three, four, four five. five. Pleasure doing business with Ultra right. Shady. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. So yeah, guys, make sure you've shared the video, tagged a friend that um you think would be interested in our giveaway. Comment who you think is going to win and you can get a few right, so Do we ask each other the questions that we've got? Yes. Yes. Right, right. Well, how else would we do it? I, I've not looked at the cards <laughs> yet, so I don't know. So, yeah. Good luck, guys. Oh, okay. The first one I wouldn't be able to answer. Oh, wait. Do you get... You can pick. You uh, get two. Right, okay. So, every card... I'm going to show you guys. Every card has two types of... Peter, don't look. Has two questions. I I know. (laughs) So every card has two questions. You got your question and your answer, and on each card there's two questions. So yeah. Which is look, guys? Who's going first? Uh, you go first. Okay. Uh, which 1996 American animated children's television series was created by Craig Bartlett? Craig Bartlett. Ooh. Did you guys hear that? I'm gonna take a wild guess and say. The Powerpuff Girls. Okay. Uh, that's your final answer, locked in? Yeah. Uh, okay. I don't know. And the question was, which 1996 American animated children's television series was created by Craig Bartlett? If anyone knows. <sighs> I'll have to tell you, Peter. That was incorrect. Oh, uh, what was it? Hey Arnold. Oh, I'd never watched it. And I did, but I didn't like it as a kid. So Peter didn't get the first... Ooh, Stacey said Simpsons. It was Hey Arnold, funnily enough. But yeah, I think keep commenting along with us, guys. Created 10 years before, actually. Was it? In 86. So you do have general knowledge. Yeah. <laughs> uh, right, so, who won the Eurovision, the Eurovision Song Contest on behalf of the UK in May 1997? Oh, that is ridiculous. This is a d- tough one. You are an awful person. <laughs> yeah, uh, this is probably one of the worst ones that you could get. I wouldn't, I wouldn't be able to tell you this. Well, can I have the question again, please? Right, so, oh. who won... The Eurovision Song Contest on behalf of the UK in May 1997. 1997. Beatles? Do you want me to tell you? Yeah. So the Beatles? No, no, not, no. Oh. no. <laughs> it, it's uh, Katrina and the Waves. Love Shine Up a Light. Oh, I don't even know who that person is. I have no idea. That was a real. I wasn't even that in was this country tough, at the time. That was not. <laughs> so currently, Peter and I are both on zero zero, as you can imagine. <laughs> Sudden death is looking so, rather you might charming. Get to a point where we just have to keep playing until <laughs> one of us gets a point. Um. All right. That's fine. Oh, one of these is really easy. Okay, that's fine. Um. The full Monty became a box office hit in 1997. Which UK city was the film set in? Ooh, 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 ooh. Is it... Oh. I'll ask the questions again for the viewers. It feels like we're doing them. <laughs> Guys, these cards are great. Check them out. The Full Monty became a box office hit in 1997. Which UK city was the film set in? Does it begin with a B? Are we to give clues? All right. Uh... If we are, then obviously then I can ask the later on as well. No, no clues. No okay, clues. that's fine. Right. Well, I'm, I'm going to go with Birmingham. Crowd. No, it doesn't. Oh, it it was no. Oh, okay, <laughs> you no. really didn't know. <laughs> it was Sheffield. Sheffield. Oh, of course it was. Amanda and Laura got of it right. Yeah, it was, it was Sheffield. Well done, guys. Um, yeah, Hannah. These questions are very hard, but I also want to win, so I have to do what I have to do. <laughs> right. Um, what? Are, th- this is the easiest one for me, at least. Okay. Uh, the, the other one is uh, one that I don't think you'd get. So I'm giving you a chance here. Okay. What 1997 gaming platform was GoldenEye 007 created for? Huh? So what 1997 gaming platform was GoldenEye 007 created for? So that game that came out in 1997, yeah. James Bond game, what platform, what console did it come out on? All right, all right, all right. Okay. Uh, PlayStation? Nah. What it, was it? 
does Xbox. Nintendo 64. Oh, that is a... Da Neither of which I don't think came out. I think PlayStation came out like... Uh, I've been bamboozled yeah. by this quiz. Um, Caitlin, I said PlayStation. The answer was Nintendo 64. Yeah, like go. Ruth has just said. So Ruth was right. And the answer to the full Monty question was Sheffield. Sheffield. Um, I'm going to... Oh. I'm gonna give you an easy one. <laughs> Who said eh oh on their first smash hit in 1997? Oh, that's an easy one, Peter. Did you not have a childhood? Eh -oh. Yeah. Um, the Teletubbies? Yeah, it was right. Yeah, All was right. right. Peter got that one Yay. right. So whichever one you get right, I'll put there. So Peter's got one, I got zero. It's all right, guys. It's fine. Two questions left. Oh my God, I'm right, sweating. Uh, I'm gonna see which is the easiest one. All right, okay. The, this. This is the easiest one. No. What famous boy band formed in 1995 did Justin Timberlake later leave? And sync. Yeah, got that one right. So I one got all, it. One, <laughs> one all. all, guys, one all. My last four questions are actually all pretty easy. So, yeah, you're in pretty. You're looking. Uh, doo -doo 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 Who was living La Vida Loca in 1999? Who was in what? Who was living La Vida Loca in 1999? Oh my god, guys, NSYNC just came on as well. <laughs> that was really weird. That so, really weird. Wait, repeat the question. Who was? Who was living La Vida Loca in 1999? Yeah, I don't know. that. Living La Vida Loca. Living... No? No, not a clue. Ricky Martin. Living La Vida Loca. Did you know it was Shrek? Yeah, I know. I it's know the song. I know the song, but I've you not don't know Ricky Martin. No. Nah. Oh my I god. Do. Well, I probably you don't do, know Ricky Martin. Don't this is what I mean with music. I don't recognise. Well, I suppose so. Yeah. Anything to do with music. Um. So what are we on? Uh, one, we're currently on one, one all, guys. Score. We've got one card left. Um. The quiz is about to end. So thank you, Bethany, for sending stars. Um. But yeah. So, last question. I'm um, sweating. Well, I've got another two left. Oh yeah, I've got another two too. So uh, another. Like a couple to go. Oh, do you? Yeah, because yeah. uh, you went first, so it's. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. Um, right, this is probably the easiest one. In which year was the Prince of Wales and Princess Diana's divorce finalised? 99? No. 98? No. 96? No, it's 96. Damn it! <laughs> <laughs> oh we've reached a thousand stars guys thank oh, you thank Woo! you very much that is that is amazing that's great thank you for the support um yeah every three are too young for these questions we're realizing it as we go along uh currently we're still on one all are one we? all one all yeah we're currently still on one all um we'll keep going so if we get a tie breaker then we'll have to just keep going, yeah, until, we'll we, keep going. until the next um, person gets but yeah them. thank you guys for supporting us we've just reached a thousand stars this is amazing uh okay Oh, I don't know whether to go easy on you or hard <laughs> on you, because these are two quite, like. I mean, th this will because I've got a really easy one for my next this one. This is so. what I mean, me too. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna. Okay, I'm just gonna go. For whatever. In the 1995 film, what sort of animal was Babe? A pig. Yeah, that's right. Right, I'll, I'll give that you. Was... I'll give you an easy one as well. And if you don't get this one, I don't know what's wrong with you. <laughs> <laughs> to, be, to be quite frank, uh, which 1999 fictional character lives underwater in the city called Bikini Bottom? Spongebob. There you go. Right, right that's so, good. We, so, guys, we're left we're with... Sudden Death. Sudden Death. So, you get a card. Should be, yeah. Yeah? So, is that, is that how Sudden Death works? It, basically, whoever gets the next first right answer Okay, that's wins. fine. Cool. Uh, ooh. Oh, I don't know. Okay. All right, guys, these are really good questions. Um, there's two, but I know that you know this one. Okay, Ooh. you know what? In the 1992 sequel, what was the name of Sonic the Hedgehog's fox side chick? Ooh. Sidekick, not side chick. Uh, <laughs> is it Tails? Yeah, that's correct. Hey, and Tails is that person there. I, did, did, did I don't know. I don't know Sonic did lore. Did you not? No. I, I know that it's the only character, other character that I know that in Shadow the Hedgehog. Oh. And so... That's that's it. I don't know tales. Do, 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 do you want to answer the last one? I yeah. mean, I've won, but oh, let's okay, go with the last let's one. Let's go. And let's have a look. Um, don't know that one. Um, Try it. Right. What did Opal Fruits change its name to in the nineties? I've never heard of this Opal before. Fruits? Yeah. Starburst. Yeah. Really? Yeah, you're good run. Are you? Yeah. Shut the fruit. Right. So if I had gone first, I feel like there, I yeah. totally should have. 
whatever. We're all the winner, but technically I'm the winner. So whoever <laughs> chose me, you're in a chance for winning. So, so well done, yeah, so. it was sudden death, guys. It took us sudden death. We both got our last questions correct, but oh, we should have done rock paper scissors to decide who goes first. Shall we do that again? Yeah, <laughs> I mean we both got that right. So we both we're going to do another. <laughs> so this is the round. sudden death, sudden death. <laughs> So how are we doing? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot, or just rock, paper, scissors? Just rock, paper, scissors. Okay, so rock, paper, scissors. Boom. Ah, ah. Ah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Wait, does that mean I ask you the question or you ask me the question? Oh, you ask me the question? Yeah. Yeah, it could be really mean. <laughs> right? So, yeah, guys, this is the final, final one. Make sure you've commented who you think is going to win the competition, who you'd like to invite to enter our competition, tag a friend, and make sure you've shared, shared, shared this video. Right, so, which film starring Mike Myers in 1992 oh, made Queen's Bohemian Rhapsody a number one hit? Star starring Mike Myers. Mm -hmm. Can I ask for a clue? Both, I... both letters are... It's two words, right? And both first letters in those two words are the same letter. So it begins with the same letter in those two words. words. Oh, that's not what I was thinking it was at all. Jay, can I have a question again? Right, so which film starring Mike Myers in 1992 oh, no. made Queen's Bohemian Rhapsody a number one hit? Oh, mother of Jesus. Uh, is anyone else guessing it? I'm going to cover the, I'm going to cover the answer. Have they guessed case. it? Uh, does anyone else know this? Oh, not quite, Ruth. Mike Myers? I don't know who that is. Although Mike Myers is, is in Austin Powers. Uh, no idea. Oh, mm, same letters. Mm -hmm. Wayne's World. Oh, I was never going to get right. that. Stacey <laughs> literally said it as ah. that happened. So that's even that you do win that round, don't, don't you? Is that right? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, okay, yeah. cool. So Peter wins because the sudden... How how do you guys all know that? <laughs> what? But yeah, um, great guys. So whoever commented Peter and has tagged a friend and has shared this video um is in for the chance of winning a 50 pound voucher we're giving two winners 50 pound vouchers we're giving away 100 pounds in total but yeah that's our 90s quiz game um like i said you get 50 cards and 100 questions in total and then you get 50 charades cards and 100 actions in total as well yeah. so yeah so we do sell this set as you can see it's actually actually a lot of fun um, it's a great set i thoroughly enjoyed that we will be probably probably bring that back so yeah we'll keep that nearby but um yeah i don't should we go through a few more products or uh, are we yeah let's go through yeah a couple more so we'll close off with a few more products um just to give you guys just a chance to be with us a little bit longer i guess yeah. <laughs> this is the massive mold and creative volcanic eruptions science kit this, um, we basically picked this out because I believe it's half term for a lot of the kids right now. So it's a perfect set to keep at home. Um, in this, you get all the lab equipment that you need. It shows you at the bottom. And I believe all you need to add is just, what do you need? Mm, oh, wait. Is it water maybe? Is yeah, you probably water? need like water or something. But yeah, it comes with everything down to the plastic cup. So this is a great um, indoor science kit also educational and fun and it's suitable for the ages of eight up so yeah it's for the older ones really but um yeah it's a big set yeah definitely I like it a, lot. a good one yep i think i'm gonna what go with, with i'm gonna go with two products because they're the same sort of theme so we're gonna go with transformers um robots in disguise as it goes um so we've got the official handbook which has um you know it goes through the, Autobots, it's got stickers in, you've got the Decepticons, you've got like puzzles, it's cool as anything. It's cool as metal. It, it's cool yeah, as metal. yeah. It, it's, <laughs> so it, you got you got like cool ones called like Underbite. Um, you've got, that's a Decepticon. So yeah, like word searches and all that um, based on, on your favourite Transformers. So if you've got any Transformer fans, definitely a good one. Mm -hmm. And then along the same lines, we have the Transformers vinyls uh action vinyls cool. so i think you can get quite a few different ones with these ones i think i believe these are sent out random uh yeah so you get ones like a uh, trail breaker rumble swoop so they all sort of look like that um but you know more vinyl yeah, they're really cool so yeah really cool transformer stuff there so um, yeah. yeah i like i like transformers a lot to be honest with you um, bumblebee's my favorite 
Uh, like Optimus Prime. Oh, of course. I love his speeches with Lincoln Park in the background. Oh, yeah. Very dramatic. <laughs> but, um, yeah, guys, so today we've covered a few of the summer toys. Don't forget to check out our penny deals. We've got five live on the website. We do change them weekly. So grab them whilst the stock lasts if you're loving the ones that we've got currently. Um, massive science kit. Perfect for indoor learning. And thank you all for just giving us stars yeah. and supporting Pound Toy, the business, we are still a small business, so we do appreciate every single one of you. Um, we will be having a goal to reach. I do believe our first goal is 5,000 stars. So everyone that's donated, donated, shared, supported today, um, you're helping thank us you get close much. to that. Yeah. So thank you. And, and uh, those who have also subscribed to us, we will be creating special content just for you guys. So make sure you join our subscription. It's 99p a month and you don't have to stay if you don't like the content. You're not tied into anything, but we will love having your support. So thanks for watching. And, and uh, final words. have a good Easter weekend, have everyone. Have a great Easter weekend. Have a safe Easter weekend. And don't forget to check out our penny deals. <laughs> That's going to be our free.